It's time for round 21, and F1 is in Brazil for the Sao Paulo Grand Prix, and the third and final sprint event of the year. That means the drivers have just one hour of practice before the fight for grid spots begins with Friday qualifying. But one driver who already knows he won't be starting the Grand Prix any higher than P6 is Carlos Sainz, who will receive a grid penalty for Sunday's race after he took a new engine in his Ferrari. And the Spaniard wasn't happy out on track either, when he ran wide at Turn 3 to avoid a slow-moving Lando Norris, and was immediately on the radio berating his former teammate. Super dangerous from the McLaren. Fellow Ferrari driver Charles Leclerc was also airing his frustrations after he felt he'd been blocked by Aston Martin's Lance Stroll. That wasn't the end of the Canadian's problems though, as he pulled into his pit box complaining of a problem with his car after running wide later in the session. Something wrong with the car. No, this is not good. There is a problem. Leclerc's hour was more successful, the Monegasque finishing second quickest and two places ahead of Sainz, as he bids to overtake Sergio Perez for P2 in the driver's standings this weekend. Perez himself went quickest of all, while his teammate Max Verstappen went third fastest, despite complaining of understeer, as Constructors' champions Red Bull set out their stall ahead of qualifying. Mercedes, meanwhile, go into this weekend 40 points behind Ferrari, and finished this session 5th and 6th quickest. Lewis Hamilton was wearing a special helmet design after he was awarded honorary Brazilian citizenship earlier this week. But that wasn't helping him with his grip level. It feels like uh, the rear is just floating around and no grip, particularly on the rear. And the Briton wasn't the only one struggling to find grip on the Interlagos track, with a host of drivers running wide as they tried to find the limit before qualifying and plenty were heard venting their frustration, including Alpha Tauri's Yuki Tsunoda, who ended up down in P19. So Perez finished the session top of the charts, followed by Leclerc, then Verstappen and Sainz. Hamilton and George Russell were fifth and sixth, followed by Sebastian Vettel in an encouraging P7 for Aston Martin. Mick Schumacher was 8th for Haas, with Valtteri Bottas and Pierre Gasly rounding out the top 10. P11 for Fernando Alonso, with Alex Albon 12th for Williams, ahead of Esteban Ocon and Stroll. Lando Norris was P15, followed by Kevin Magnussen, on his 100th race weekend with Haas. Then Nicholas Latifi and Joe Guan Yu. Sonoda was 19th, with Daniel Ricciardo 20th after a tough session for McLaren.